Fucking love Sam Hyde, man. Is he uh is he boxing this weekend or is it No, I think it's two weekends from now. Who's he boxing? I can't remember. Is it I, one of those like streamer things or it doesn't fucking matter. Yeah, it's uh happy boxing. Yeah, the candyman. The candyman Sam Hyde. Uh it's for happy punch boxing. Him and Keemstar have a boxing company together now. Nice. So it's uh that should work out great. Uh, I want to call out DSP. I think I can take him. You want DSP? I want Ethan Ralph. I want to fight Ethan Ralph. You fight DSP. Undercard? Top card. I'll fight Ethan Ralph. We'll have a great time. Bumba Close says uh, Sam needs to fuck up Hassan. I don't think Hassan Piker wants any part of Sam Hyde. It doesn't sound like he's interested uh, in that fight in any way, shape, or form. Uh, did you see Jordan Peterson's dreams? Oh, uh, didn't you send that to me? I didn't. I feel like I got that sent to me, the uh, Jordan Peterson dreams thing. If I didn't, could you send it? Uh, nope, I don't have it. Ah, shit. Oh, well. Uh, if you have the link, uh, please. He says I sent it to you. On Twitter? I don't think I have it on Twitter. Oh, wait, yes, I do. Never mind. Fuck me to death. I've got it. What is Jordan Peterson's grandma dream? Story goes viral after 23 years. What the f Please tell me there's a video of this. I don't... Jordan Peterson dreams about his grandma. Uh, before we even hit play on this, may I just write it down mm -hmm. quickly? Uh, I will be clipping this out. Jordan Peterson. Well, uh, listen here, bucko. Do you want me to cut it off? Pull that thing. Stretch that thing out. I'll cut it off. Uh, Curly Adam says, did you cover Bam Margera on Steve-O's podcast? No, but we'll probably do that tonight. The Bam Margera, Steve-O stuff. Steve-O tried really hard to be nice to, uh, Bam? To, to Bam, and he tried to give him the benefit of the doubt. But even like Steve-O, who's a nice guy and has a lot of empathy for people who have addiction problems, even he had to call Bam out on a lot of bullshit. And... You can very clearly see in the interview that Bam is still not okay. Like, he's still greasy and fucked up and everything else. Uh, you were sent a really good clip about a Spirit Airlines employee fighting a woman. Disregard. What? I want to see that, too. I want to see all this stuff. Why aren't you guys? You guys say you send me this stuff. I don't see it. Uh, let's take a look here. This is uh, Jordan Peterson. I have not watched this. We're going in cold with this. Uh, Jordan Peterson. We're going in dry. A dream. Dreams about his grandma. This is apparently a 20-year-old clip. Oh, boy. The way you guys are sending it to me doesn't make it sound like it's in a good light. Jordan Peterson, everybody. I dreamed I saw my maternal grandmother sitting by the bank of a swimming pool, which was also a river. Her genital region was exposed. Okay, uh, number one, a lot of you men who are going to watch this either as a show or as a clip, look up to this man as like your self-help guru, and you leave mean comments and you tell me I'm a bad guy when I tell you you probably shouldn't do that. I'm going to tell you one more time. You probably shouldn't do that about old Professor Granny Pussy Dreamer here. That just, I mean... Listen to yourself talk, man. Sitting by the bank of a pool, which was also a river. Sitting on the dock of the bay. And I'm staring at my grandma's pussy. You'd think on this dream I'd punt. But I gotta tell you about granny's cunt. Oh, she's just a sitting on the dock of the bay. Letting her labia float away. <laughs> oh. 14 of the dreams I had. But all of those just seemed to make me sad. So I dreamt of grandma's gash. And I gotta say I had me a blast. Oh, she's just a sitting on the dock of the bay. Stroking her flaps like she's playing guitar all day. Oh, she's just sitting on the dock of the bay. Flicking her beans. 
clits. Well, clit bean. We had the same. Yeah, we're in there. Feels like nothing's going to change. Why does Aaron and Steel Toe think I'm strange? Oh. Look at this photograph. It's of my great granny's gash. <laughs> Criminal record says I broke in twice. <laughs> I must have not in there a dozen times. <laughs> Granny's the first girl I kissed. <laughs> Gave her a pearl necklace and I nearly missed. <laughs> In my problems, that dream didn't... Oh, no, I'm mixing the two songs. Yeah. Uh, I'm trying to think. I have a word I want to rhyme with, but I have to get the first line done. Mm, that's always the bitch. Oh. Uh, the dream, it didn't make a dent. But my granny's pussy was over exuberant. Sorry. All right, I'm sorry. Let's. Can we restart here? We're being very unprofessional. Really should have taken a bet. That she was going to be that damn wet. <laughs> oh. I'm through I'm through with having those dreams where granny never lets me in. It's like a cunt's on display and I'm never going to win. This, this dream hasn't turned out quite the way I want it to be. It's what you want. I need a condom that is a magnum and a... Sorry, I just... Uh, a little Spanish fly while granddad's packing. I dreamed I saw my maternal grandmother sitting by the bank of a swimming pool, which was also a river. Her genital region was exposed, dim... <laughs> you know a dream, <laughs> you know my granny's like a river. Always watching her pussy flow. And my dick is just a vessel that must follow where she goes. Try, trying to look at what's behind her, but never knowing what's in store. Every night I have a bad dream that my granny is a whore. Dream a little dream of my V. God. Which was also a river. Her genital region was exposed dimly. It had the appearance of a thick mat of hair. Oh, she had granny has a bush. Well, that's my bush. <laughs> Sorry. She was stroking herself absentmindedly. Oh, get the fuck. I mean, really? This guy's your stop idolizing people. I don't care if they're good. I don't care if they're bad. They're only going to let you down. If you like this show, just like it. That's enough. If you hate this show, just hate it. That's enough. Don't ever hold people like this in high regard. She was stroking herself absentmindedly. That's like right. She never even noticed that she was squirting. That's right. She looked down and she went, oh my goodness, I'm diddling my clit. Granny had Alzheimer's and she would just sit there and masturbate publicly. And none of us knew how to fix it until one day Uncle Frank decided to Kneel down ever so gently and give it a nice sloppy kiss. Jordan, she was stroking herself absentmindedly. And then she said, oh my God, I'm edging. <laughs> He's got such a fucked up family though. Like his daughter, Michaela, is probably like, oh, you dream of grandma playing with her pussy, but not me. Thanks a lot, dad. What was the point of covering for your apple cider vinegar lie? After and this then video. shilling my, my meat products. The next uh, family gathering after this video, like Thanksgiving or whatever, she Daughter's just up on the table. See, aren't I hotter than Granny? <laughs> I don't even Jesus. have a bush, Dad. <laughs> Jesus Christ. She walked over to me with a handful of pubic hair compacted into something resembling a large artist's paintbrush. What the f At what point is this an admission that you need to be in like a, a loony bin? So is, and by the way, those of you who'd really downvoted our last Jordan Peterson video saying I'm reading too much into it when I said he was mentally fucked up and needs serious help, I'm expecting an apology and a like and thumbs up and subscription from you because apology accepted. Thank you very much. She yanked out her own pubic hair like some kind of a weird fucked up masochist. 
And uh, she, she gave it to it me. She ripped it out of her head like that chick from The Boys that does it every time she gets pissed off. She treated her pussy like Mick Foley treated mankind's head hair. <laughs> she pushed this at my face. I raised my arm several times to deflect her hand. Finally, unwilling to hurt her or interfere with her any further, Don't I let her. her have her way. She stroked my face with the brush. Oh, the puby paintbrush. She let his grandma tickle his face with her pub brush. Oh, my. I'll never eat salmon again. <laughs> Gently and said, like a child, isn't it soft? I looked at her ruined face and said, yes, grandma, it's soft. I dreamed. So Jordan Peterson really wants to fuck his grandma. <laughs> had a dream. Now, look, I can't look yet. Yeah, you have your dreams. Okay. You just, you have your dream. You can't control. Maybe you don't share them. Right. You can't control how you dream, <laughs> but you can control whether or not you share that dream. With the rest of the class. And I'm just saying that maybe that was not a story that needed to be shared with the rest of us. There goes my hero. <laughs> that one was from uh, KF, of course. Sage retard, PhD KF. Uh, Gordy says, please, please stop this audio. I'm getting hard and do not want to. <laughs> Raz of Chaz saying this has to be fake. No, it is not. It's a 20-year-old clip. Of good old Jordan Peterson. Everyone's hero. See, that's the other thing. People people get this hero worship for this guy and they'll go, nope, I have to believe it's fake. No, are, now, are you saying that because you have some kind of proof that it's fake? Or is that what you like need to know? Or are you saying or you that need it because to be true? you can't reconcile loving Jordan Peterson and Jordan Peterson loving his grandmother's yeah. pussy hair brush that she put on his face and... Asked him if it's... She gently wafted my nose as she tweaked my nipple. I could not help but explode in my pants. Look, at any rate, what I'm trying to say is clean your room. <laughs> no, I'm going to make it as messy as fuck. I'm just going to do the opposite of what you tell me at this point. 